hey guys welcome back to the channel and we are back again with yet another review video so this time guys we have with a uh, smartwatch so this smartwatch guys that you can see over here is from the brand called hammer so this is hammer active 2.0 ultra smartwatch which is kind of a clone to the apple watch ultra so we are going to go ahead and look into this smartwatch how is this watch what are the features that we're getting with the watch what is the price range of this watch and is it worth buying let's go ahead and check it out guys so let us quickly first go ahead and unbox the product guys so guys let me tell you while i'm unboxing it i have purchased this product from amazon guys and and this has costed me uh, 2199 from amazon i have went for the orange variant which is there so in the box guys you can see it's a normal box with some of the key features that is mentioned over here guys you have the price the apps QR scanners and things like that so let us see what we're receiving inside it so let us go ahead and open okay so here is the watch guys so this is how the watch is fitted this is how it looks like guys I can I hope you can see it it's quite heavy uh, this is full metal body guys this is how the watch looks like this is a functional button over here another one over here you have all the indicators mentioned given over here this button also works over here and there are actual screws on it guys and also clips to hold the strap band I'll give you a better view of this guys just first let me unbox it so let's see what else we have received over here okay so this is something nice this is a wireless charger guys with the hammer branding over here a USB a cable they have given charging pair of straps thick quality is good okay so they have given us the warranty over here you have the warranty details the user manual so this is good they have not given a thick manual literature so they have given you the qr scanner guys you can just scan this and the pdf version of the manual get will get downloaded let me quickly now go ahead and remove the branding of the sticker from here I have a sticker branding guys I've removed it wow this is looking nice guys indeed let me remove the wrapper from the back so they have given clean wrappers like this removing it now let me just turn on the watch Okay, once I turn it on, there is a hammer branding, guys, which is coming. Now, let me just quickly go ahead and set up the watch, guys, and let me download the application. They have an application called the Massware. Let me quickly go ahead and download the application and show me. Let me show you the watch and let me take you through all the features. And guys, so these are the things that we're getting. So this is the watch, guys. Let me give you a better closer look. The speaker grills you have the mic over here this is a shortcut button you can use it you can modify the options that you want to use this button for it's a good screen guys the screen size is really nice you can see the display the display is 1.95 inch screen guys it has a 550 nits brightness and you have the optical crown button guys over here so this is a functional button guys the crown button over here you can see it's working this is again the lock unlock off button guys you can keep pressed it on and you will get the shutdown button and the sos button over here you have the different sensors given over here guys also see these are actual screws not any fake ones and you have this over here which is more of a like a button for the strap which needs to go in through here 
with that we have the warranty details so we have just set up the device i'll show it across to you how it's looking so this is the wireless cable guys the chargeable wireless cable and this is the strap guys okay now let me just quickly go ahead and connect the straps attached to it so let me tell you you can see this is the front side so on the cable you have something called a black spot and this is the silver spot so the black spot is going to be on the top so you just need to go ahead and connect it over here so now guys let us go ahead and connect the straps so you have a black spot over here you need to connect the black spot you need to keep the black spot on the top it gets locked over here guys as you can see this is locked now also guys let me show you one thing guys what you need to do you need to press this button over here you can see there's this button you need to press it and you just need to slide it it will come out that's how you open it now once you connect it guys there is a sound of a lock that gets so that you can figure out it's locked over here now the other strap guys again the black spot over here stays on the top There's a noise stuck noise that's there you get to hear it so now quickly i let me open this watch this is a noise smartwatch which i'm using guys let me keep this aside how is the fit okay the comfort is good the fit looks good not bad i must say yeah so this is how the watch looks on the hand guys so this is how the watch looks on the hand guys let me give you a better look of it there's a wake to rise feature so it's off right now once you turn it the it turns on this is how it looks guys so it's good now let me take you through to all the features of the watch one by one guys okay guys uh fine now let's let us look into the key features of the watch so we have the watch with us right now this is a dialog screen you can see this is the screen that you get to see in the original apple watch but this is a clone more of a clone you can see the hammer badging over here this is this crown is functional guys if you keep pressing this upward or downward the lock screen image changes now you can access the menu by pressing the crown over here now this is the menu outlook you can change it by double tapping it over here let me show you see it's changing like this way you can just change the menu whichever you like it now what are the key features so you have a message option there are over 100 plus sports modes there's sleep monitor then you have steps count heart rate you can monitor it over here again i would tell you not to totally rely on it obviously for any serious health conditions please consult a doctor then you have blood pressure so the animations are almost the same for everyone this is bluetooth camera this is then the music the find my phone the weather option over here you can you get to see it over here then water reminder stopwatch let me show you the stopwatch animation this is the water reminder animation stopwatch reminder okay you have a calculator which is again functional see it's working alarm you can set an alarm from here as well guys we'll come to settings later on so menu style as i see you can double tap it and change it or you can press on the menu style and change it from here as well now brightness guys this watch has a brightness you can click on it this is third level you can you can go up to five levels uh, currently i'm on the third level this is the fifth level the brightness is awesome guys screen timeout you can choose by how long i after idle use of your watch the screen will get timed out you can select it from here also if you have noticed from if i'm swiping from left to right the watch goes back to the previous page 
connecting the qr reset okay this is a voice assistant button guys so if you if there's anything that you want to search on or your device so your default search engine on your phone if you press start and speak on it the default search engine is going to search whatever you have set on your device so these are some of the inbuilt games which are given over here you have the torch guys over here now this is race to week option which i've kept it turned on languages you can choose for games women's health is another option which is given a very good and very important feature for nowadays everyone is using a smart watch so this is a very important feature guys so this is the dial option you can make calls from here you can save up to 20 contacts guys over here I'm not connected to the with the Bluetooth the contacts. Once you get connected, you can save up to 20 contacts on the watch. Message option. So yeah, these are the features, guys. And let me come to the settings option. I said I'll show you at the end. Settings. So in settings, guys, you have the Bluetooth option, race to watch a week option, the sidebar, vibration. If you if an incoming call or message is coming, if you want it to be okay, notified, you have the vibration option over here. Then the button setting guys so this is let me show you you have a siren a ringtone options the modes that you can select torch nothing so this is for this button so this is a customized button guys so whatever options you select from here this will be a direct shortcut for that button for that option so the brightness i've already shown you this option time setting you can change the format of the times uh, guys from here date or time both you can change it so this is a bedside lamp option uh, languages sidebar again if you want to lock your phone you can come over here you can turn on the password you can set up a password so always on display guys this is another feature all watches is coming with this feature nowadays you can turn it off as per your choice guys yeah so with that comes up with all the most features of the watch guys now let me just quickly go ahead and show you the interface the watch inter it has an app support which is known as massware m-a-s-w-e-r you will find the qr I'll, or the, and the link to download the application in the description of the video also guys and let me show you the interface of the app now okay guys so this is the application massware you need to click on it once you set up the application this is how it's going to look for you guys the interface so you need to click on equipment and then you need to connect your device by uh, the bind option over here there are some of the features that you can control from here they have any nfc option also available but i have not used it so i can't tell you whether it's a functional on or not so there are list of uh, so many over 100 plus dial options that you can go ahead and change and select from so there's this work dedicated workout option where your gps will be tracked over here you can view from the location to which you're moving you're running you can track everything over here guys now this is the shortcut to you can see the app over here guys this is how the animation looks like So yeah, not much to do in this app. I won't say this is a great application or interface, but yeah, it's okay. Also guys, let me show you. Uh, let me show you when the watch is charging. On um, This is the animation that you get to see guys. So this is the smartwatch guys, the clone Apple Ultra watch from Hammer. This is Hammer Active 2.0 Ultra and in the watch is not a bad uh, as for physical appearance it looks more very similar to the apple ultra it's a good watch the interface could have been better the features are not that bad it's good okay let me tell you a few things the step count it's it works sometimes it doesn't work sometimes it's not working properly number one a uh, number two option guys the call notification option 
I think it's not that good. They could have worked on it. It's a it's a software thing. So an update they can do it. The sound quality, the mic, it's it's not bad. It's good. I've checked it. Overall, guys, on you are paying twenty two hundred for this watch. So should you go for it? I would say it, it depends on personal choice basis, guys. If you want Apple clone watch or watch that looks more like an Apple Ultra. Paying twenty two hundred, I would say it's not a bad deal. You can go for it. If you want a Apple uh, Ultra looking watch, a watch that looks like Apple Ultra, if you want it, you can go for it. Price is okay. The features that you're getting with it is not bad. You can go for it. But if you think that if you want to use it as a smart watch with you in which you need all the proper features working on it, then I, and the look is not that of a concern. Then I would say you can skip this. There are other watches. Other than that, in in this price range, if you just watch a smartwatch with some looks like uh, Apple Ultra looks, you can go for it. With that, guys, we come to the end of today's video, guys, uh, and I hope you have enjoyed the video. So we uh, there are very less reviews on this pro product, so that's why I wanted to get this product and do a review for you guys, and. Uh, so that's it guys uh, from us today i uh, hope you have enjoyed this video guys and hit the bell icon guys so that whenever a video is uploaded you get notified like share and subscribe to our channel let's review with krish and the most important thing guys please subscribe it's it is completely free for us but it motivates us to go ahead and make for more videos for you so for more upcoming videos guys stay tuned with us we are coming with further more review videos as well thank you